Hi everyone, Nightmare Game here, and I'm back with more Dark Cloud. Uh, last time we were, I said that I would meet you here in the dungeon, and so here's where we are in the shipwreck. As you can see, we have another level that has three, six, seven, eight atlamilias on it. So let's get searching for those. It probably also means that it's going to be a very tough as hell uh, level, along with bunch of areas to explore, so let's get started. Also, it's kind of foggy down here, too. Hmm. I don't think I like the looks of this, guys. I mean, it hasn't been this uh, foggy in a while. Oh, God. Thank God for the um, anti-freeze amulet. I forgot if I mentioned what enemy it was in that last area that had the uh, key. I believe it was a, um... Actually, you know what? I have no idea. I forgot already. Sorry, guys. I would love to tell you and you'd be able to find it immediately, but I have no idea, so... The worst lines you can hear from a person that you're possibly using as a walkthrough is, you're on your own. I just hope you get as lucky as I did and don't lose any, like, get too close to losing any levels on your weapons. I mean, it won't go down a level, I, I already know that for a fact, but you know, it does drain your ABS all the way down if you're unlucky. Oh, Leaning Tower, huh? That sounds interesting. Actually, I'm gonna take a big risk. Okay. What weapon will I use just for the fun of it? Let's see, um... Oh sure, let's use this Bone Reaper right here. Hey, fun's increased a little. I like the sound of that. That's really nice. Okay, let's uh, go to the uh, Sax weapon. Let's change back to, uh... Nikita here by pushing the wrong direction. That's always a good idea. There we are. Oh, great. Did you, you suck. Well, fire pellets don't really seem to work too well against it. Annoying? No, I think he's a real pain in the ass. Switch over to uh, Lady Sure since he's so close. 69, what a good of damage to get. Ah, hey, ABS is finally full again. Yes, because I think I have a fly on me when I don't. My skin is crawling for lack of better words. Alright, now we need to put... Holy crap, look at all this junk we're starting to accumulate. Um... Well... What does it possibly... What does it need now? Thunder and wind and holy. Or if I want to do the next level up, I need more fire and more ice, so I guess I can always just do that. There we go. Uh, 
taking their chance there. There's three things about the million in this room, but I'm kind of waiting a little bit. Alright, here we go. Now we know where all of it is. So it's kind of hard to shoot around the left side of the pillar. Oh, that works so well. Turns plus one, that's nice. Okay, let's come over here. There we go. And actually, if you uh, rather, it actually still use the same thing as before. It says there's a switch that looks kind of like it looks like I think it says something like oh, there's a log on the ground or something like that. It's kind of funny. Massive piranha, a jar, and an anti medusa. Great. Yep, I saw that coming. Really, I'm not gonna have much luck with uh, Michael here. Oh, because of that freaking chariot. I'm telling you, that's the. Like I said, like before, this is my least favorite enemy in the game. Well, at least one of them. That uh, enemy Sam, he's my other least favorite just because he'll kill himself, you know, if you're not using the right attribute against him. God damn it! What the fuck do you want from me, game? I'm hitting him without getting hit myself. Yeah, I saw that. seems like all the enemies in this area are for Lady Shura only to kill, because I mean, I swear to god, if you try to kill that chariot guy with Michael, he gets his ass handed to him. If you, definitely if you try to kill him with uh, John, he gets his ass handed to him. So I don't get it. It's locked, force an open may activate a trap, I don't have a treasure chest key, trap must be explosion, alright. Hell, I wish it was just like, um, Wild Arms, because then I could just send out my best person who could easily just break the trap themselves. <laughs> uh. Anyway. Or better yet, have, um, my little mouse friend come and open it for me. Then he wouldn't get harmed and it wouldn't matter. Damn. Sometimes you 
fucker, stop. Ah. I'm surprised that worked as well as it did. Using wind against that when I really shouldn't be. Alright, let's use another cheese to prevent ourselves from dying. Let's go to weapon and change the attribute to something more useful. Like thunder. There we go. By the way Luigi says it, THUNDER! Or something like that. But you won't know what game I'm talking about, don't worry about it. There, we got him. Shit, I almost like walked right into that. That'd be kind of funny. No, god damn it! Ah! I almost lost that weapon. I would have been so pissed. Like, I would have had to turn off the mic and hold my breath. Because I would have screamed the F word at the top of my lungs. I'm not even kidding. And I would have loaded it to the game. Because I am not losing a weapon that I've leveled up this much. <laughs> Especially one that I think I used a um, rare item on. That's bullshit. <laughs> I, I swear, it would have been like the scene from Simpsons whenever um, uh, Homer Simpson has that bad thing happen to him and he tells his kids to leave and then all he just takes a deep breath and screams. Uh, the F-bomb as loud as he can, and you hear it all through the town of, um... What the hell is that town called? You know what I'm talking about. Basically, he just screams it throughout the town, and it, everyone, is, everyone around is like, What the heck? <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. By the way, you can eat that gooey peach if you're stupid enough to do so, and you'll put yourself in a gooey state. Not that I'm calling you stupid, I'm just saying, you know. <laughs> I don't know why you would try that. <clears throat> We've tried it for you, don't worry. I swear to god, that fly just landed on my nose. It was disgusting. I was like, ugh! Go away, you little piece of shit. Actually, I think this guy is actually weak against fire, to be honest, but whatever. <sighs> what do we need to build this up? Attack, speed, and magic. Ice, wind, holy. And nothing there. Okay. Why did I put a diamond on it? description. Easy to use single-handed sword. I don't know why did I take the time to say single-handed because I don't think you ever get a two-handed sword in this game. But of course I, I like how they do that though. The description is really nice all the same. You know? You gotta admit to that. We got the map a little too late in my opinion. Uh, this is obviously a king mimic because I mean there can't be two of the awesome big chests in a row. damage. Gotta say, you're awesome. Every time that happens, I'm just like, that is freaking awesome. Okay. Um, wait. There's a music box. Do I have anything for a music box? Tell me I have to come through here and do this floor again just to get to that door. <sighs> ah, I got 
Yes, let's finish up the town, because I think that's what you have to do to get it. Hopefully I collected all the Alamelia, or if I didn't, I'm like, gonna shoot myself. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I would never, uh, do something that retarded. <laughs> hmm. I don't know, that's kind of heartless to say. Anyway, let's see what we have here. So we got the Cathedral. Divining House. Oh, that was gross. I'm sorry. I try not to burp as much. I, I know it's kind of silly, but I am trying very hard not to. Handsome boy with a secret. And you manage a cathedral? Hold on a sec. Sorry, my ear itched really bad, so I had to take my headset off for a second to take care of that. Um, Lana store probably needs fruit carts. Yep. Okay. Okay. Put the roads wherever you see fit. Hell, you don't even have to put them down if you don't want to. And most of the time, I just... Ew, that water's green. That's disgusting. Okay, anyway. <laughs> How can I help you today? Today is my grand opening. I have a wide variety of water. <laughs> Welcome to the store. Michael, you seem to be traveling a lot. I'm sure you need lots of water. You always find something refreshing at Susie's. I was just wondering. Can I ask you something? The name Susie's it isn't quite right, is it? I've been thinking about it for a while. Um, I'm just gonna do this. Is it? Really? It is? Okay, it will stay as Susie's. I think you can have the option to change it. Thanks for helping. Let me give you something. Probably could have caused it so called it something ridiculous, but oh well. Please come visit Susie's again. Let me see something. Have you heard of the gourd? Drinking water from a gourd allows you to retain more water in your body. You already knew that, right? Damn, I thought I could uh, change the name. I'm doing fine. You don't have to buy anything. It's okay. Just come and see me sometime. Oh well. Here, this is what she sells. She sells regular water, tasty water, premium water, stamina drinks, antidote drinks, and holy water. Basically, I don't really see a point in that. Anyway, I feel bad because I think I um, 
could have had a chance to change the name. And since I haven't saved in a while, there's nothing I can do to fix that. Damn it, come on, game. I mean, it may have looked like I did because I had it hovering over that one time, but yeah. I haven't saved since I started, so... We're just not going to be able to change her name, which is fine. Besides, I want to know what to change it to anyway. Let's just configure everybody else over here, just to kind of put them down for a little bit. That's a good place for a cathedral, though, if you ask me. And the Divining House. Alright, let's grab the items from these. Fire coming out of here. Can I stand on it? Nah. <laughs> Stamina drink. Mage Slayer. Gourd. Oh boy, you have a bad omen about you. Be careful. I'm Yaya, the town fortune teller. Hee hee hee. Good to meet ya. Hello. Hmm, your name is Michael, huh? Really? Not a good name. Oh well. <laughs> what a bitch! Anyway, <laughs> any requests? Well, the white snake dwelling in this. Divining House likes to see the rising sun, understand? Great, another one of those damn things. My trademark is a snake. That's most important. The snake! If you forget it, my fortune teller will only be half as accurate. Okay. Now let's go to the other house and find out what they want. Or the cathedral, so to speak. <sighs> it really bums me out that I missed out on that thing. Oh well. It's not like I could have asked you guys anything about it. Alright, let's go inside. Holy gem. Oh yeah, by the way, gotta make sure I have plenty of room for items. I can fit one more item in my list. Yeah, I forgot what I mentioned. I gave a gourd to Mike off screen. carry 10 items. So, uh, okay. I don't remember that at all. So, hey, we both learned something today. I'm gonna steal this thing right in front of you, dude. <laughs> oh, well, it seems you, it seems that you have an important mission, I can tell. My name is Phil. I'm a servant of God and the keeper of the cathedral. Wow, they actually said God. I'm surprised. If there is anything I can do for you, please don't hesitate to ask. Usually God is something that's kind of touchy subject in games. Anyway, so you are Michael with no space. And you're the boy who has the power to manipulate the legendary gem at Lamelia. How the hell do you know that? I see. Minion here must be faded in some way. I hope we meet again. Any requests? The tower is a source of sacred power. If the cathedral is close to the tower, it would be easier for me to listen to God's words. And I want the cathedral to face the ocean so I can pray to calm the spirit of the queen who threw herself into it. Okay. Anything for your place? I really need the emblem, the symbol of the cathedral. It has to be placed on the wall of the entrance hall. Okay. Can do. And then in the next episode, we're going. I'm going to have. Sh I'll just show you how the world's supposed to look. I'm not stopping it yet. I'm just going to take care of putting this place together. I mean, these places together. Oh, yeah, I need 
on my ass to down. Talk to her. Uh... Look at what lets me put it over the rope and not the tree. <laughs> I would not mind having to put the tree back. Ah, here we go. Let's just put her, um... Right there. Oh, shut up. Come on. Fruit of Eden. Poisonous apple. And a gourd. Alright. I think that's enough gourds for all of our teams. Yeah, well, I should have gave two to Lady Shura. I forgot all about that. Damn. There I go again being a moron. Can't use it on yourself. Okay, never mind. Awesome. I'm good. I'm glad to know that. Uh, is that all the treasures? Yes. You're not from around here, isn't that right? Welcome to Queens, a beautiful seaside merchant town. My name is Lana, which is a girl's name, but you look like a guy. <laughs> nice to meet you. I'm an asshole. It probably is a girl, and I just don't really see it. This is a merchant town. It's like one huge market. Everyone owns a store. You don't see that too often. Anything for your place? I had three pushcarts with fruit. Two are not enough. Please remember that. Okay. Then I'll ask what the hell you want after that, too. Yeah, it's taking forever. There we go. Oh, there's another chest there, too, now. Oh, hi, it's you. How may I help you? Good timing. I've opened my store again. Make sure to visit often from now on. Oh, wait just a minute. What, you're gonna give me a banana? I don't want a freaking banana. You better have something good beside a banana or I'll kick your face in. Here, this is my gift for you. Damn it! A gooey peach. I don't want that either. Come in any time. See you. Throw this gooey peach right in your face! Ah! God! And another one! What the hell, game? This is ridiculous. You should just steal this push card. Just, just push it away from you. Just push it all the way over here just to be an ass. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm gonna stop the episode here, and uh, when I come back, I'm going to have fixed the level the way it's supposed to be, and then um, show you it. Till then, everyone. Bye.